Hey, so what's going on everyone? It's your boy Mac here. And um, about a couple of weeks ago, to a month ago, I can't actually remember. It's been a long time. I ordered um, the Grinding Gears mystery box package thing that they um, were advertising through their game. Um, I decided to put, take a punt on it. It cost roughly um, about... 80 pounds my money and a lot of that was due to shipping um, usually I'm one of these that don't usually buy anything that if it like the shipping's absorbent but it's from New Zealand and from what I can remember um, some of the stuff that could potentially be in this bag right here um, is you know worth it in my opinion um, I do play a lot of Path of Exile, I do play a lot of it, um, so yeah, I thought I'd, I'd unbox this, I'm trying to get the, um, get the, the sticker off right now, so that I don't have to, like, myself on the I've only got out, ready, I've off, I've ready for the four, so I'll be able to So let's see what we get. Oh wow, okay. Um, so I'm just going to take them all onto my lap so that I don't know exactly what I've got. So the first one we've got. Um, <laughs> okay. So we've got ourselves a t-shirt, we've got, it looks like we've got many t-shirts here. Ah, so we've got this one, we've got this t-shirt which will look cool. I like the um, Path of Exile t-shirts, they do wear pretty well. Um, I've ordered from Jinx before um, for different games. Um, I've also got my Path of Exile hoodie and t-shirt for the supporter packs so that I know that they run well. Um, I've also got um, a Solaris vs Lunaris on a t-shirt, of course everyone, everyone has gone through the campaign at some point or another, or at least if you've done every season you've gone through it at least once or twice because unfortunately Path of Exile you've still not allowed us to just skip the campaign, god damn it. Uh, we've got another t-shirt, yet another one. I've just seen the the toy, it does look pretty cool. So we've got another t-shirt, Haunted Paradise. Can't think exactly. That's Act 1, I believe, from the uh, from the Mud Plains, or whatever it's called. I can't think of what the actual area is called. Just after the beach. So that looks pretty cool. And... <laughs> This just looks really freaking awesome. Um, and it's an Exile Con exclusive, so obviously unless you went to Exile Con, you only got this, or had the opportunity to buy this, other than the amount of bags that they've done. Um, they've actually released more. They've, I believe they've released a thousand more or something, so I'll put a link in the description for them if you're interested in buying one and testing out your gambles um, I can't think what this is called actually what's the what does it say I can't remember what it's called but I'm gonna keep it with its label on it's quite big I've got I've got fairly big hands and this is let's see whether I can there you go a sprite bottle 500 ml sprite bottle there you go so I don't know roughly what that equates to. It's, it's a big thing. It's a big chunky boy. But um, it looks pretty cool. It would look well on a shelf. When I decide to put the shelves up, which God knows when, but um, it will be part of my game collector's shelf. I'm trying to think what it's actually called. Does it actually say? Just... I don't know. You're going to have to figure out and tell me in the comments exactly which monster this is. But anyway... Thank you all for watching. I uh, hope this is 
swayed or dissuaded anybody I'll put it in the background just where I usually and you can always check it and put it in the background there yeah that looks pretty cool but anyway um I'll see you guys in the next video um if you can go follow me on twitch I sometimes do streams over there twitch.tv forward slash fight mac fight and um yeah See you guys next time. Take care. Thanks for watching.